It's been four years since the reproductive health law was passed and obstacles still stand in its way. Just this year, 1 billion pesos was cut from its budget. In this report, Rex Ramisho tells us how this affects many Filipino mothers. 37-year-old Mary Jane Butin is expecting her sixth child. The pregnancy is unplanned. She used to take contraceptives, but not anymore. She claims she got toxic goiter because of the pill. Mary is unemployed and her husband earns minimum wage. Nowadays, they live from hand to mouth and life is getting more difficult. The World Health Organization says the Philippines has been lagging in Southeast Asia when it comes to sexual and reproductive health. With a population of 104 million, 28% or 1 in 4 pregnancies in the Philippines is unwanted. In Cambodia, it's at 12%. Also, 2 out of 3 Filipinas do not use birth control. 1 in 4 women get pregnant in the space of a year. They prefer traditional methods. And worse. Among the people who have, who have uh, the first sexual encounter, 78% of them are not protected. The United Nations Population Fund says the situation is more serious in the slums and the countryside. There's still a, a large unmet need for family planning among women, particularly the, the poorest of the poor, who are having, on average, up to three children more than they would want. The Philippine Commission on Population says leaders lack political will. One of the problems we're fighting against is uh, the apathy in, uh, in most uh, sectors towards reproduction and uh, this is coming from the fact that for the first decade of the century uh, national government was not that supportive of the reproductive health there's already clamor to fully implement the reproductive health law but then at the start of 2016 lawmakers removed the 1 billion peso budget for contraceptives Moreover, health workers must be monitored, as well as the distribution of services down the line. They make sure the right message is out, they make sure that the health workers know the messages, and they make sure that it's available. Mary Jane says she learned her lesson the hard way. When asked if she would welcome another pregnancy, Rex Remedio, CNN Philippines. Brazilian side.